Hi, everyone. Welcome back to the Frugal Watchbox channel for another watch comparison video. Today, we'll be comparing two of Casio's affordable dive style analog watches. The MTP VD012EV with a blue dial and the MTP VD01L7B with a white dial. Both watches are priced around $22. Let's take a closer look at both. First, we have the MTP VD012EV with its sparkling blue dial and the MTP VD01L7B with its striking white dial. We'll start with the blue dial. Let's delve into the intricacies of the case dimensions. Case size, 45 millimeters. Lug to lug distance, 49 millimeters. Thickness, 10.3 millimeters. Lug size, 22 millimeters. Weight, 79 grams. The bezel is numbered from 10 to 60 but is unfortunately fixed. Both the bezel and the case are chrome ion plated. The medium sized crown is ensigned and protected. The hour markers are a combination of circles and bars with a double bar at the 12 o'clock position. Despite their white appearance suggesting they are illuminated, they are not. The prominent Casio logo sits below the 12 o'clock mark, followed by the Water Resist 50M label, and at the bottom is the Japan Movement imprint. The date display at the 3 o'clock position has a matching white border. One interesting feature is the sunburst effect of the blue dial. The hour and minute hands are sword-shaped with hollow lower ends, while the second hand has a distinctive design with a yellow arrow tip and a silver counterbalance. The strap is a standard Casio diver-style resin strap, cheap but tough and dependable. The stainless steel buckle is ensigned, which is expected at this price point. The stainless steel case back is engraved with the model number, module number, and water resistance rating of 5 bar. Next, we have the older MTP VD01L7B, which I bought about five years ago and wore daily for about two years. The dimensions of these watches are similar, so there's no need to discuss the white dial's dimensions in detail. The bezel is also fixed and chrome-plated with a similar protected crown. The main difference is the dial. The MTP VD01L has a white dial with Arabic numerals at the 12, 6, and 9 o'clock positions, and bar markers for the rest. The positions of the Casio logo, Water Resist 50M label, and Japan Movement imprint are the same as on the blue dial version. The date display also at the 3 o'clock position has a white border. Regarding the hands, the hour, minute, and second hands are similar in shape. The second hand is striking red instead of having a yellow arrow tip like the blue dial version. The MTP VD012EV stands out with its sunburst blue dial. The MTP VD01L features a leather or imitation leather strap, which gives it a classier look compared to the resin band on the MTP VD012EV. However, the bands are interchangeable, so you can upgrade them as you like. Again, there's no Casio logo on the buckle. The stainless steel case back is somewhat scratched after five years but still looks tough and dependable. The chrome plating has worn off, revealing the golden brass base, demonstrating the watch's durability over time. Let's put these 45mm watches on my 6.5-inch wrist. 
First, the white dial. It's a bit big, but not overly so. Next, the blue dial. Again, it's slightly large, but not too intrusive. So guys, which do you prefer? The blue or the white dial? Or both? In terms of loom, they are similar, with only the hour and minute hands illuminated. The loom seems brighter on the MTP VD012EV due to its darker dial, but otherwise they are similar. Okay guys, that's all for today. Thanks for watching, and catch you again in the next video. If you found this video useful, please subscribe and hit the like button. Bye for now.